A new little feature for the blog. You know, sometimes when you're talking X's and O's on the radio, it's hard to always describe exactly what's going on. And what we're going to try to do on a weekly basis is break down a couple plays, be it from the Seahawks or Husky games, the real X's and O's as to why that play worked and functioned the way it did. And I'm going to pick one from each side of the ball from Sunday's Seahawks 49ers game. And the first one is going to be the touchdown pass that Deion Butler hit because you're going to see some some similarities, a little bit of history with this play. Uh, first of all, they came out into a trips formation. Trips just simply three receivers. Uh, the split end to the weak side, Mike Williams. They were in, in shotgun, and this is when it's seven to six, right after the turnover, and ultimately this turned into the touchdown pass to Deion Butler. And, and initially, when Matt is under or in the shotgun and he looks out, the initial look by San Francisco. Not the most favorable for this play. They had really one, two, three defenders to match up with the two receivers. Also a linebacker to take care of John Carlson. But as the play unfolded, there's a couple things to really remember. Number one, John Carlson is going to outside release and he's going to run a 15 yard in. And now your two receivers are going to run this concept of about a five yard in and a five yard in. Now this is a look if you were to watch the Indianapolis Colts for the last 13 years, this is play number one in their playbook, either from a two by two set or in this case, a trip set. And it's really the same concept that Tracy Porter, this New Orleans Saints corner, intercepted Peyton Manning. Now remember that was to this side and it was only a two by two. But when you heard Tracy Porter break that play down, he said, yeah, I knew they came in motion. And once I saw that inside receiver outside release, this five yard in is such a common play. And Jed Fish, Jeremy Bates, both guys have spent a ton of time with Peyton Manning, the Colts breaking down that playbook. And this is really one of the staples of the Colts system. This DB out here, Terrell Brown, knew that. This is a play they've run in the preseason. And he knew when they got into this set, he probably had his eyes on the tight end who outside releases. And then he's keeping an eye on what's going on in front of him. And everything in his keys is telling him double in, double in, double in. And that's why it's such a brilliant call with as aggressive as San Francisco was playing for Dion to come in and sell that. Brown bites and then ultimately the double move for the touchdown. So think a couple things. Think Peyton Manning and the Super Bowl against Tracy Porter. Very similar concept. Number two, think Matt Hasselbeck and his eyes and his ability along with these routes to sell to Terrell Brown that this is in route, this is in route. If Matt is nonchalant and doesn't give that intention of throwing that in and then Deion Big Butler doesn't run a brilliant route, that's not a touchdown. But it was, and it was because the tendency said to San Francisco, 15 yard in, double in. And good thing for the Seahawks, they break that tendency with what turned out to be a huge touchdown to go up 14-6.